A small private school in Rochester is celebrating the first day of school and 30 years of education. Cobblestone School is an independent elementary school located on Prince Street off of East Avenue. YNN's Wendy Mills joins us now with more on what makes it an alternative school. Well, Cobblestone staff and parents refer to the school as a community of learning. It's a holistic approach designed to connect kids' lives and learning. Hey, sweetie. Kristen. A first day tradition here at Cobblestone is tea, muffins, and fruit for parents to say hello. Hi. Cobblestone opened in 1983 and educates children ages 4 to 12. It's proud of small class size, about a 12 to 1 student teacher ratio. It does not have standardized tests. It believes kids should be partners in education. About 60 students attend this year. Director Rose Martin admits the economy has challenged the private school, but is determined to keep it open. Fueled by staff, parents, and children who embrace Cobblestone's living curriculum. It's not very often that children are asked, what do you want to know? What do you want to learn about? What are your questions about the world? And we do ask them, and we use those questions to create a living curriculum that's a, a response to the children who are in your class at the moment. Beth Garver Vihay's daughter is starting her fourth year at Cobblestone. At Cobblestone, I see it as an intellectual school where kids are actually taught to interact with one another. They're taught um, real life skills. So it's portfolio based learning versus test taking. So, you know, for those of us who went to college or even didn't, you know, jumped into a job, they didn't say, take this test. Okay, you passed, you can do the next step. It was like, do this project. So it's project based learning, service learning, and the kids are engaged. Students here are from all over Monroe County and from the city of Rochester. Now, Cobblestone changes its grade levels based on student enrollment and needs. Reporting from Prince Street in Rochester, Wendy Mills, YNN.